What do you do in the face of overwhelming darkness? Shine all the brighter, like Ronald Reagan did in the face of communism. Mr. Gorbachev, tear down this wall. Reagan was proven right when he said, evil is powerless if the good are unafraid. Political correctness, as people may not recall, is a term that was born in the Soviet Union, where thousands, if not millions of people died because they tried to quash religion and because they tried to quash political assent by sending people to gulags. Don't let this happen in America. It's not as if America is exempt from the laws of history. Um, we will crumble, like all civilizations before who embraced and celebrated sexual immorality. And it's not just the homosexual activists. As I said, it's our, it's our popular culture. It's sexual sin. But this is part of it. And this is really the only sexual sin that has its own parade. Having seen seven Iowa Supreme Court justices declare that, uh, that marriage, that our, our Defense of Marriage Act in Iowa, which I was one of the authors of that language when I was in the state Senate, that that was null and void and unconstitutional. And they granted a right to same-sex marriage to anybody that was in Iowa or would come to Iowa for that, that met those standards of two consenting adults. Um, that was judge-made law, and I went on the judge bus tour. One day there were seven, and the next day they were four. And every judge in America got that message before the sun came up the following morning, and every attorney in America understood that before a week was up. Text and tweet your friends who may be overwhelmed by the darkness a reminder to shine. Because in the battle between darkness and light, light wins. <laughs>